Hi everyone and welcome. So in the previous video we have covered that how you can download and install Ace Code programming software to program the Ace Board STEM kits. Okay, if you want to watch that video and if you want to download and install then you can click here to watch that video. Now in this video we are going to cover the getting started guide for the Ace Board QD020 Bionic Spider Kit. Okay, and we are going to upload the app control program from the Ace Code software to our Bionic Spider Kit. So I have already uh, built the Bionic Spider Kit and we will see how you can control that spider from your Android application. Okay, and how you can program that entire kit. So here on the camera, you can see I have uh, built the entire kit. Okay, now we will program this and then we will see how you can control that using Android application. So first of all, you can download the GitHub repository. Okay, I will provide this link in the description of this video. And here I have uploaded the all code from the Aceboard. So if you open this folder and here you can see Aceboard QD020 Bionic Spider Robot. Okay, and uh, we are going to program this uh, robot using Ace code software so here is the Ace code folder and inside the folder we have two other folder tutorial and the Ace code program so we'll go to the Ace code program and then we will directly jump to the lesson 8 to control this robot from the android application now you can download this okay i have already uh, that code available in my local system so i'm going to open that here Okay, Ace Code Program Lesson 8 and here you can see 8.1 App Control SB3. So you can open this. So you can double click and open that uh, program in the Ace Code software and here you can see the entire code. Okay, now all you have to do is you have to connect USB-C to USB cable okay, from this robot to your system. So here is my uh, cable. Okay, so I'm going to connect this cable with my boat. Okay, and then I can connect the second end of the USB cable with my system. So we have connected. Now we can again go to the Ace Code software and here you can see COM port is available. So our uh, spider boat is connected on the COM4. So I'm going to select the COM4 and it is our ESP8266 board. Okay, so that's why you have to select ESP8266. And then after, what you can do is, you can just click on the upload button. Okay, now here you can see upload in the progress. So this entire code is created by the Ace board and this is absolutely working fine to control your spider robot from the Android application. So you just have to hit on the upload button after opening the code, it will compile it okay and then it will write the code to your robot so let's wait until it completes the hundred percent now here you can see the percentage 29 percentage upload is done and here you will see the next step okay 59 88 okay and it is successfully uploaded okay here you can see upload progress 100 percent now uh yeah let me open the camera so we have successfully upload the app control program from the ace code software to this spider robot kit now what we can do is here you have the turn on switch okay so here you can see we have the turn on switch so you can turn the switch on and here you can see it will set to its initial position Okay, once it will set to its initial position, you can remove this programming cable and you can open the Ace Boat Android application in your phone. So let me grab my phone. Yeah. So here is my phone. I'm going to open the uh, Ace Boat application. But before that, we have to connect with the Wi Fi created by this spider robot. Okay, now here you can see I have another Wi-Fi quad boat hyphen E. So we have to connect with that Wi-Fi. Now how to get the password of this Wi-Fi. So if you open the Ace Code software, now here you can see 
this is the SSID name and this is the password. Okay, so we can see that SSID on our camera that I am connected on the same SSID quadboard hyphen E and I have already provided the password, okay, which is 128. Now, once you connect with that Wi-Fi, okay, which is created by this spider robot, you can uh, go to Acebot application and here you have to find the Bionic Spider option. So, once you find that, you have to click on the control, okay. And once you click on the control, there is one link button here. So, you have to click on this link button and we are connected with this spider robot. Now, let make this spider robot swing. So, here you can see it is swinging. Okay, now let's make uh, the handsome operation. Okay, let me, uh, yeah. Okay, now I am going to run the handsome operation. Okay, now let's run the dancing operation. Okay, now let's run the sleep operation. Okay, the robot is in sleep mode. Now let's run the lying operation. Okay, so it's lying. And you can also go forward and backward using this control. Okay, so if you press this button, then here you can see it is going ahead. If you press this button, then it will go on the backward direction. Okay, again in the backward. Okay, right, left. Okay, and here it will turn. Okay. So, this is how you can control this spider robot using android application and uh, we have already covered that how you can program this okay so all you have to do is you have to download this entire repository you have to open this app control dot sb3 program in the ace code software you have to connect your uh, spider robot with your system using usb to usb c cable here you can see okay you will get this kind of cable with this boat so you have to connect um, this boat with your system and then after you can just click on the upload button so once you click on the upload button it will compile the entire program and then it will upload to your robot and then after it will create one wi-fi access point okay you have to connect with that wi-fi access point and then after opening the application you have to select spider boat and you have to click on this link button so it will link with this uh, boat and then after you can operate it okay it can also do the push-ups so i hope everything is clear so this is the getting started guide for this ace board spider robot kit that have you program this spider robot using ace code software okay with the app control now in the next video we are going to do the same but instead of ace code software we will see how you can program this boat using Arduino IDE software. Okay, how you can set up the Arduino IDE and how you can open the program, how you can upload the program and then after how you can control this boat, okay, from Android application. So, in the next video, instead of Ace Code software, we will program this boat using Arduino. So, let's meet in the future videos and to assemble this boat, I will provide one link in the description of this video. Okay, you can watch that video and that video covers the complete guide that how you can assemble this boat. So, stay tuned for the future videos. Till then, take care, goodbye and thank you.